just a little update on my repaint of the Sideshow Collectibles Premium Format Catwoman head. This is my bathroom sink. This is my uh, workstation, I guess. Anyway, here we go. All done. Repainted the eyes green. Uh, gave a thicker, thicker black eyeliner and a bit more eyeshadow. Red lips, and I glossed the lips and glossed the eyes to make them shine and look wet. So now she's much more to my liking. Green eyes, a bit more intense eyeliner and the red lips. More of an Arkham City kind of look. Now I am a complete amateur when it comes to doing this kind of thing. I'm not, what I, you know, I don't do custom work for people. I don't do, you know, professional stuff. I do mess around with my own collectibles from time to time like this. Uh, I just didn't like the blue eyes and just, you know, just wasn't too keen on the overall look. So I thought I'd give it a try myself. I do know other guys like Stephen Morris and um, Brian, too many figures, people like that who would be able to do this for me, and Nenny D, people like that. And sorry about that weird noise you're hearing in the background, I guess one of my neighbors is doing some drilling. But yeah, I mean, I just thought I'd do it myself. I've done some one six scale sort of custom things like this as well. But I thought it would be easier to do. Oh, and I did paint that tuft of hair black as well. The hair, that's black now instead of brown. Um, but yeah, every now and then I like to try and do something like this. I think it turned out okay. I can live with it, I'm happy. I'm glad I didn't screw it up too bad. Can't tell you how scary it was repainting the eyes and doing eyeliner and fine, fine, tiny sort of detail work like that is really scary. <sighs> but I'm glad it's done. Anyway, I'll give you another little, uh, another little update once this is back on the body. I just wanted to show you the repainted eyes and the lips and the hair. The eye makeup, not perfect, but it looks good enough. And I am happy with that. So there you go, guys. There she is. All right, guys, we'll just have a look at the head back on the body. I'm very pleased with how it's turned out. Uh, it just seems a bit more striking now with the black hair, the thicker eyeliner, the green eyes and the red lips, and the touch of gloss on the eyes and the lips to make things shine a bit. It just looks cool. Very happy. Uh, I don't think the green is really coming through on camera very well, but maybe in a second showcase video or something down the line, get a better look at them. But yeah, I'm very happy with the result. That's the, the look I wanted. That's the look I got now. I'm very pleased. Uh, I picked up a couple of Adam Hughes comics uh, from Orbital Comics up London yesterday for like two pounds each. That was great. There was that one and that one. Yeah, that's how she looks. I don't think I'm going to do anything to this head. I just like the way it looks, and I'll leave the lips alone. Don't want to risk messing that up. So I'll leave that be. This I'm very pleased with. So once again, that's uh, made the black, made the brown hair black, thickened up the black eyeliner, painted the eyes green, and repainted the lips red, and then applied a gloss varnish to the eyes and the lips to make them a bit more, bring a bit more life to them. And that's how it looks. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, and uh, more videos coming at you soon. Picked up a nice little NECA treat, um, a 30th anniversary figure by NECA, which I'll show you very soon. It's very cool. And uh, got a couple of other little Catwoman treats on the way in the next two weeks. One statue, one figure. And uh, obviously, let you guys see that as soon as they arrive. Alright, see you later.